Well, we are talking about your monthly rent going up about $180 since last year. Now, that inflation plus the pandemic and a shortage in the housing supply means the Community Action Agency is getting hundreds of calls every day for help. I moved to Cincinnati in 2020. I wanted to live somewhere that was affordable. At the time, it was. Now, rent has gone up a about a total of 180 to 200 dollars. So Gary um, Cooper finds himself working extra hours and, to get by. And it, it just really puts on a strain mentally. Cooper isn't alone. Um, According to data from commercial real estate group CBRE, the overall rent in Cincinnati for market rate housing increased 17 percent from 2020 to 2021. And the agency expects rents to increase again in 2022. The impact of the pandemic has not subsided, and we are seeing it daily with not only the phone calls a day, but well, Dr. Ebony Griggs Griffin is the VP of Community Services with the Community Action Agency. Since June, the agency has helped distribute more than $7 million in federal emergency rental assistance funding in Cincinnati. But she says the need isn't going away. Landlords are jacking up prices. Clients are struggling with finding affordable housing. Right now, the agency has 900 applications pending. People looking for help with utility, rent or mortgage assistance. It's a possibility that some landlords are taking advantage of the fact that we they the moratorium is lifted. We can evict some people and it's an opportunity to hike up prices or it's also landlords that may be struggling. And I hope Sharon St. Clair is dealing with it firsthand. Her rent in North College Hill went up $125 this year. It's hard sickening, it's nerve wracking. And the Community Action Agency still has more federal funds to distribute, so they are encouraging that if you need help to reach out, we'll link to the resources on our website. That's WCPO.com. Reporting in Bontel, I'm Marielle Carbone, WCPO 9 News.